turn. Jerry, a lot of our colleagues like John Morris Rankin and Howie MacDonald and Natalie and Ashley and David McIsaac, yeah. they all uh, admire and appreciate your music and look up to your compositions. But you know, it amazes me and it amazes all of us how you, as a carpenter, with your sort of big carpenter chubby hands, <laughs> and you produce this fantastic, sweet, to your tone is impeccable. And, yeah. I, and I, I study you closely at times, and I can't figure out how... You've played in my kitchen a few times, mm -hmm. and I just hear these notes, but I don't, I don't see you making... You're very gentle the way you play, very soft for a, for a, a big man. Well, it comes from in here, like you yeah. say. Um, I guess there's some that would say that, that I am just soft, in, <laughs> and maybe in more ways than one. <laughs> uh, I think it's a music that doesn't have to be rough. Jerry, what are your plans for the future? Plans for the future is to play my heart out, I guess, is about the size of it. Uh, wherever, whenever. Uh, I guess if, if people can get uh, or receive happiness from it, that's what I want to do. I want to bring them all the happiness I can. Well, Jerry Holland, you've done a lot of that. You've left your mark. Uh, keep on composing and uh, keep on fiddling, and thank you. Thank you so much.